Um, it's a the problem. The problem with it is uh, there's an, so many issues, and I'm yes. a fan of Whoopi Goldberg. I've always been a fan of her, uh, but there are so many issues. With what she's saying it does reveal an awful lot about the confusions that people have around anti-Semitism that are explored yeah. in my book. And the principal, one of the principal things going on here is the resistance to the idea that anti-Semitism is racism. And I think what does Whoopi Goldberg think it is? Well, I think what a lot of people think it is is religious intolerance. And the problem with that is. I'm an atheist, and the Gestapo would have shot me tomorrow. My great uncle Arno, who died in the Warsaw Ghetto, was not an observant Jew. And indeed, now, it's not just the, the, the Holocaust. Now, neo Nazis marching with torches saying the Jews will not replace us in Charlottesville, they would not ask a Jew whether he kept kosher before they set light to their mm -hmm. house. They're not interested in faith, and the Nazis were not interested in faith. They were interested in racial purity. That's what the laws, the Nuremberg laws, were. They were racial purity laws. But that that comment suggests that there are people who think racism is only about the colour of your skin. Yeah, no, that's true. And there's a specific thing that I think is going on here, which is, you know, Jews... Uh, the whiteness of Jews mm. is a very complex thing. I use this phrase in the book, it's a bit early for this, but anyway, called Schrodinger's white. So what I mean by that is Jews are seen as white or non-white depending on the politics of the observer, right? So far-right groups, and y for years and years, centuries, have seen Jews as not part of the white races, absolutely part of Hitler's project, to say Jews are not part of the Aryan white races. But meanwhile, on the other side, on the far left, the association of Jews, which is a racist thing with power and privilege, makes them kind of super white. And what that ends up with, it's similar to, to be honest, in the Black Lives Matter thing with mm. saying all lives matter, because it takes away from the specifics of the racism to something very bland and general, like man's inhumanity to man. OK, but what's going on here is actually a very particular type of genocide. She talked on Stephen Colbert's show about two sides fighting. This was not two sides fighting. This was an ethnic group being marked out to be destroyed Eliminated. by a military-industrial yep. machine.